So today, we're going to talk about automatic water dispenser. Yay! Yay! Uh, no, no, this isn't the RX-69 XT RGB Batman and Robin Marvel Super Duper Edition. No, no, this is just, it's a regular water dispenser. We'll, we'll put it, a picture here. It's a water dispenser, you know, to, to dispense water. Yeah. Welcome back to the channel. If you're coming back, if this is your first time, hello. Again, I am the Computer Guy. This is the Computer Guy Reviews. And we are going to talk a little bit of something different today. We are talking about a water dispenser, which is a little different than this channel. Normally we talk more about computer oriented or something a little bit more tech oriented, which I mean, I guess this kind of is. It's it's USB charged lithium battery and stuff. And it's it's kind of, it's, it's, it's along the premise. Just, just stay with us. Just stay with us, John. Stay with us. Yeah, it's something that uh, Silent Birdie and I, since, again, the intro we are in the rv this is going to be we're renovating it right now for us to live in full time this was something that uh, silent birdie and i wanted to have on the rv wanted to test out a little bit beforehand this is a product that it fits onto one of those five gallon jugs the reason why we were looking for something like that was because we felt like the five gallon jugs is pretty much the biggest you can get and go fill up at places the stuff we're going to fill up mostly in our water tanks is going to be mostly um, dishwashing and stuff like that. It's not going to be our drinking water. So that's that's what we got this for, was so that we could have some five-gallon jugs, put the dispenser on it. There we go. Uh, there were a few brands uh, from these, from what we were seeing, but I believe this one was BP-free. At least the description says it is. You got to believe the descriptions, otherwise, what's life worth living? And I'd like to take a moment to thank you guys for making it this far in the video. And if you'd like to share, if you think it's funny or whatever, just informational, whatever, and share this out, there's a share button down near 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 the sub button. Hey, there's a good segue the sub button. And while you're clicking on stuff, you can click the sub button if you're not a sub already. And click the thumbs up because you you know. You guys, you guys like me. Right. Yeah. Yeah, you guys like me. So one of the things that I did want to mention about it does not come with the caps. For those that don't know, the five, normally the five gallon jugs, buy a jug like from Walmart, it'll come with a cap because that's just the cap that is meant for to, to you know, send it out to places. It's not meant to permanently be on there. As soon as you pop it off to go try and fill it up, that's it. It's gone. One of the things we bought was a... Uh, silicone kind of it's it seats over top of it but it also makes it so that you can fit this dispenser on it so technically this review is technically two reviews we've had we've had this one for over two months now the battery i charged it up out the gate and i still don't know if it changes color <laughs> whenever it is uh, like the battery is low on it like that's how long this battery lasts um, just for giggles I charged it up again it didn't seem like it took that long and we've gone through we go through a whole five gallon pretty much very consistently every week so we've gone through you know at least a dozen gallons already <laughs> and and as a side note also that uh, there's lots of times, uh, at least once a day, that I'll run it, and this is a, actually a nice feature. Um, I like the ones that when you press the button, you don't have to sit there and hold it, because that gets tiresome, because then you got to hold the bottle uh, that you're trying to fill, or the cup, or whatever. You're trying to hold that, trying to hold the button, and whatever, and that gets to be tricky, whereas if you can hold both of them, see that it's coming up to where it needs to be, press it again, shuts off. Or it has a feature, which is what I was getting to, with uh, if you're going to try and fill smaller jugs, like gallon jugs, off of this, I believe it's a liter and a half is what it'll do, and it'll do an auto cutoff. And I say that because it almost fills up a two liter bottle, because I've had it just, just to test it out, 
Um, it's almost filled up a two liter bottle and I feel like that there was at least a half a liter from the top. That's why I'm guesstimating about a liter and a half. So I'm, I'm guesstimating, but the point is, is that it has an auto cut off. Again, pretty fast charging. I, I, like I said, I couldn't even begin to tell you how, it doesn't have a very large battery. It's a small enough pump that doesn't use a lot of power and it's very efficient. We talked a lot about the pros and stuff, so this this is kind of falling under the cons. Things, things I kind of wish it had. So I, again, I don't know what the battery is on it. I kind of feel like there should be a better battery indicator on it. I don't remember it going any different colors other than red when it's charging. That's the only thing that I know. As far as the charging port, uses micro USB. I probably would have liked to have seen it as a type C possibly. But I, I also kind of understand, again, back to the, the lights thing, it's inexpensive, it's meant to be inexpensive, and it's, I can kind of see that. I would say if you wanted to make an upgraded model, Type-C would be something I would think about doing. Trying to clean it is a little tricky. That's, that's about the only con that I really have for it. As a recap, great price. Did I not talk about price? Oh, I guess I, guess I didn't really talk much, but we'll put, we'll put the price up here on the screen. So it's a great price great deal um, it's a very efficient motor for the battery that's in it it's fast at pumping it'll fill things up fairly quickly maybe would have liked it to be a type C but again and the battery indicator but again those aren't deal breakers so I'm gonna give this one a five out of five I like it I like it a lot hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, yeah that's that's the end of the video like comment and subscribe um, if you guys want to see more things like this, um, leave a comment below. We'll try and get more of this stuff. Um, I do plan on having more RV related stuff when we get our solar stuff, when we get the battery, charge controllers, all that other fun stuff. We do plan on doing more reviews of stuff like that. So stay tuned to the channel and again, hit the subscribe with the bell button so that you get notified when we do that stuff is the computer guy apparel check the link in the description and we'll see you guys in the next video ow